In this video, we'll be creating a web scraper to scrape data from this website. We'll be using a no code tool to achieve this, that tool being Simple Scraper. You can download Simple Scraper at simplescraper.io and you'll need to be using Google Chrome in order to download it. For this project, we're going to be scraping data from quotes .toscrape.com, a web scraping sandbox. For each quote, we're going to be scraping the quote and we're going to be scraping the author. For your convenience, I've timestamped this video for you in the description. Let's begin by initializing our scraper and setting it up. So when you're ready, head over to quotes.toscrape.com. As mentioned, we're going to scrape each quote and the author. With the Simple Scraper extension open, it will allow us to select the first data point that we want to scrape. All we need to do is click on the plus sign, then select the data point we want to scrape. First, we want to scrape the quotes. So if we hover over the quote and select that, it will highlight everything in green that will be scraped. We can name this data point quote and click the tick to set it for when we run the scraper. Second, we want to scrape the authors of the quotes. Again, we click the plus sign, then we select the author of the quote. We can see it has highlighted everything in green that will be scraped when we run this scraper. We can name this data point author and click the tick to set it for when we run the scraper. Now we have all the data points selected which we want to scrape, we just need to run the scraper and it will work its magic with no code. To run the scraper, click view results. Once the scraper has run, Simple Scraper will work its magic and return our desired data. It then gives us the option to view that data in a table or as a JSON file. And at the bottom, we have the option of downloading it as a CSV or a JSON file as well. This project is now complete. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like this no code project, Please give this video a like and if you want to be notified of the latest no code projects that I publish every week, please subscribe. I'll see you in another no code project.